So how important is having a good support team for an independent? The difference, be I think the difference between a good company and a great company is when you have an issue, they're there to help you, right? You can actually call somebody. Um, you're able to get a hold of them. Uh, in our, our organization, right, you've got a sales guy that sold you the deal, so you can contact them. But on top of that, you've got a PM that's responsible for your account as well. So you have kind of a, a hierarchy of people that you can call to get support. But in my opinion, in this day and age, you have to have a good support model. And a lot of the, a lot of the companies now, that's gone out the window. Like the, one of the last companies I was at, I, I should say, um, but their whole thing was they had a lot of support people. And uh, a company came in and, and bought us. And the first thing they did was they cut support. We had about 380 um, support guys. And they cut that 380 to about 80, you know. So, wow. so support is, is huge. You're going to have issues. You need to be able to get a hold of them. And when you have a templated site, guess what they're going to say? Well, that's what you paid for, right? That's what you paid for. You got that, you got that little templated site. Nobody else is having that issue. But, um, yeah, we'll – We'll get to it when we get to it or send me an email and let me see when it happened or whatever. You know, our average ticket turnaround is better than anybody else's. It's, it's phenomenal.